Hi, it's Dan from my Reality Change. It's May 11th, and it's a beautiful spring day today here in New Hampshire. The skies are clear for now, a little hazy from all the calm trailing, but what are you going to do? Alright, today I'm going to uh, just go through a boonini meeny miny mo on this uh, the right navigation camera. Alright, so let's do that. Let's see. Newer ones aren't that good. Boom, boom. Do that. There's a lot of images in this one. We might find something that's decent. Let's see. Uh, <coughs> I like the ones with a lot of rocks. I haven't seen these before. They're all tracks. But you know what? I find stuff in the tracks. How is that possible? Mm -hmm. Anytime you take something, alright, and you boost the contrast on it. Let's do this one. Oh, wait a minute. These are those cheapy, cheapy little sample files. What's going on here? Oh, this is all I got for regular ones. Save it. And uh, let's see, six is the one I'm using for all these. Save. Go back over. Pictures. Six. And eh, where the hell was it? That's the other thing I gotta find it. Is that it there? Yep. Okay. So it's um, actually it looks like this. Oh hell, the cat turned on the, on the cat toy. Hang on, I'll be back. Okay, that little drama just uh, ended. Let's see. Darn cats get in everything. Alright. Let's take a close up. There's trash all over the place. Anybody, any of you guys ever watch any uh, Richard Hoagland? Pretty good. He thinks this is all pieces of machinery, and I gotta agree with him. But, and I say but, right? So let me explain what Hoagland says. Hoagland says that the entire inside of Gale Crater was once a huge structure cut from 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 uh, crater edge to crater edge that was 50 miles tall all right and he believes that it all collapsed down on itself and what we're seeing here is what was in that building and that's been eroded out over the years pretty interesting he's a he's a smart bastard I'll tell you but I the thing that I get is ain't what the hell are these things? These guys, this, this is a person standing here. Look at, you can see his feet on the other side of this, whatever it is. Here. <coughs> see it? Let's try to... Yeah, push that up a little bit more. Uh, take it down a little. That's good enough. You get the idea. Alright, now you back off. What's it look like to you? Looks like a guy standing there. 
How about these guys? What, what, what's this? Hmm? <coughs> Sorry about the cut. My, I had a cold for like weeks. Yeah, let's see. Let's go, go right to the... What do you see? Personally, I see two people that have been blurred out by NASA standing there. That's what I see. Okay. Let's see. In fact, here's what I think. I think this rover is like the biggest, not only is it called Curiosity, right, but they flock to wherever it is to take a look at the piece of machinery from Earth. And I'm saying to you that this whole area right here is full of people standing there that have been blotched out by NASA. Okay. Let's see. What was I doing? Here's what I'm going to do with this. I'm going to put, make it sepia. All right. And this way here, you get better control over. off the bat. Okay, there's somebody here, here, there's people here, here, here. See, there's three of them here. This one here has got a, 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 a suit on. Could be from another race, but this one's got long black hair. You see the V of her shirt in her face. Okay. I gotta run, so... I'm just going to give you a quick and I'll be back with something else later. Okay, now here's another one here standing there back too. They're all over the place. Just stop this video and, and just look. Just look at it. Okay, and you will see the same thing I do. Not only do you see weird artifacts, but you're going to see people. I gotta go. I'll see ya. Bye.